You're watching Hastings TV and this is the Break Stuff and then giving away as a competition prize show. Now we're in the middle of testing the A-Data SH93, which I would have here to show you, but it's actually currently undergoing tests. And the tests that we're doing right now are according to Military Standard 810F. There you go, Military Standard 810F. This is Military Standard 810F. Um, very carefully filed away by Stefan last time. Um, and in here is a temperature variation testing, which is what we're putting the A-Data SH93 through right now. So let's go through and see how it's doing, because right now we're doing cold temperature testing. And uh, so um, we, put it in the we put it in the fridge. Is that it? Is that the best we can come up with? We put it in the fridge. Oh yeah, there it is. Yeah, okay, there we go. So, oh, it does feel quite cold. It does feel quite cold. Right, so um, there we go. So we need to actually test now. It's been in the fridge, whether or not it's actually still working. This is probably the most boring test we've done. Whose idea was it to do this one? Was this you? me? I didn't. No. The temperature testing I had in mind was something a bit more severe. Right, there we go. So we've got the blue light come on. This will go babong in a minute to say. Yeah, there you go. There it goes babong to say that it's actually recognised the device and it'll come up with a little dialogue box to say, do you want to view the files and all this sort of thing and we'll watch Charlie Chaplin. It's getting a bit the same, this, isn't it? There we go, open a folder to view the files. Here's the video. There's Charlie Chaplin. There we are, Charlie Chaplin's working. Right, okay, Charlie Chaplin's working, that's fine. Um, but I think what we need to do is we need to do, what I did read in here was about the, it's in here somewhere, not that one. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Right, yes, okay, so it's the temperature variation and then um, being able to sustain a massive temperature differential. So going from one temperature to another. So that's what we're going to test right now. So this is still fairly cool. How cool does that feel? Does it feel around about three, four degrees? Yeah, okay, right, so there we are. Going to stick it in the tub and now we need to get it hot really, really fast. Now you can have your tea later. Right, so kettle full of boiling water, or just boiled water, onto the drive. There you go, that's temperature variation in action right there. So, it's gone from five degrees up to around, well it's gonna be about 95 degrees, something like that, for just boiled water. And I don't wanna take it out now, because it's gonna burn my hand. Um, <laughs> it's really hot, it's really hot. <laughs> ow, 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 ow. Right, let's take a little plug off and uh, let's just plug it in. Okay, so now did it survive going from five degrees rapidly up to around about 90 degrees? Look, you can see the steam coming off here. Look at that, okay. Yes, we've got the uh, it's found something. Let's just close that because it's come up with an error because uh, I just pulled the drive out. And what's it going to do? The drive's flashing away there. It's reading and open folder to view the files. There we are. There's a the video. I've got water all over my laptop screen and here's Charlie Chaplin. It's still working, there we go. So the SH93 still works, even when you take it from the fridge and plunge it into boiling water. Um, but I did see something which you got out earlier, Stefan, uh, which is something that we are going to test it with in a minute. Where did you get this thing from? If we want to do some serious seat testing, this is what's going to happen next. Check back soon on Hastings TV for more from the break stuff and then give it away as a competition prize show.